here we would like to discuss what is easy if suppose we are having a body shall we push that body or shall we pull that body so let us consider the same body for both the cases let us pull and push with the same force and identify what happens which is easy and which is difficult so let us consider the body on a surface let us this is our body i want to do both these things simultaneously one for the push another for the pull but we are going to do the same let us consider a point where the mass is concentrated called as center of mass let us apply a force we generally push the bodies with a force by making an angle theta to the surface let us imagine the same kind of situation let us pull the body with the same angle and with the same force so we know whenever uh, you are trying to move the body push or pull the body is always moving in a forward direction so it is obvious that as the body is moving in a forward direction it is supposed to move in both the cases like this and in this case also it is supposed to move in the forward direction then friction comes into the picture which opposes the relative motion and hence this is the direction of the frictional force this is the frictional force in the case of a pull and this is the frictional force in the case of the push i want to calculate in which case there will be more friction and in which case there will be less friction of course these bodies are having some masses it is obvious that their weight will be always acting in the downward direction due to the gravitational force that is universal we cannot stop it now in the friction that what is the frictional force that we have applied we want to calculate let us see about the external force that we have applied we can resolve this applied external force into components the components shall be always along the direction of the vector the vector is towards the origin therefore this f cos theta will be towards the origin this is called resolution of vectors this is also towards the origin let us try to resolve this force this is also horizontal and vertical components but as this force is going away from the origin the components also will go away from the origin we can clearly see here f cos theta is a driving force which is pushing the body here also the f cos theta is a driving force which is pulling the body the force that is acting pulling and pushing acting is same but look at the normal reaction in the first case you know normal reaction means there will be some resultant force acting on the lower surface because of the upper surface the downward direction normal reaction will be of equal magnitude opposite in the direction and normal to the surface of the contact it is very clear from this diagram that in this case normal reaction is weight as well as f sin theta because both of them are acting in the downward direction reaction also will be equal to the sum of them but look at this case in this case normal reaction is weight minus f sin theta why because that f sin theta is actually acting in the upward direction so if i want to write static frictional force in the case of the push i will write mu into normal reaction in this case normal reaction is what mg plus f sin theta similarly if i want to write static frictional force in the case of the pull coefficient of static friction is same because the surfaces are same but the normal reaction is less so it is very clear from this that frictional force in the case of the pull is less than that of the static frictional force in that in the case of the push as friction is less in the case of the pull pulling will become easier than that of the pushing that's why pull is always easy than push that's why we can see many people on the streets pulling their bodies generally they don't push the bodies they know it by default that by experience that pulling is easier than that of the pushing because frictional force is less in the case of the pull when compared with the push therefore we shall always 
pull the body if you want to make the job little better easily but not the push.